The Visual Arts Center is a place where people can learn and grow their artistic ability. Today we will be focusing on a teen drawing class which is held every Wednesday afternoon. This class helps kids learn how to make their very own characters, make comic books, and basically how to express their creativity however they can. So basically, uh, we do tons of uh, drawing in this class. We really get the freedom to work on whatever we want. Um, it's a cartoon design class, actually. Um, so last session, I worked on a cartoon. I think I, I'm, I'm very proud of it. But now I'm just working on whatever I want. You know, just like some sketches, some whatever. You know, it's cool. This class allows for the kids to make new friends and express creativity in a fun way. As you can see, it is one of the most popular classes here. Here to talk about the class is the man who runs it himself, Mr. Doug Barron. All right, I'm Doug Barron, and uh, I am a, an instructor here at the Visual Arts Center in Summit, New Jersey. And I was asked to do this interview by Jordan. Hello. He's a student of mine. I've been working with him since he was about this tall, and now he's this tall. I, I do my own comic book, so here is the comic book. It's called Jump Back Adventures. It has the Flying Quasimodo Brothers, Sugar Ray Finhead, and Little Jim Bob Bigfoot. These are characters I made up, and I tell my own stories with them. And it's all comedy, adventure uh, kind of theme things, because I love monsters. Here's a monster picture I'm working on right now. This is London After Midnight. It's an old uh, black and white movie. I still have not seen it yet, but I've seen a lot of images from it. And this is one of the famous Lon Chaney images from that movie. Another example of something here is Pikachu turning into a Hulk uh, Pikachu. It's a Hulk, a Pikachu Hulk. And what happens, this is a rough sketch. This sketch is just quickly done. It's done with shapes. And then I take the sketch and I do an inked version of it. India ink comes in a bottle and you dip a brush into it and you brush these lines over your, your pencil sketch. So I went from this rough drawing to this and this is scanned into the computer and I use Photoshop. It's a program where you do all your color and special effects on the computer to finish this piece. This is an event in Clinton, New Jersey. It's called the Haunted Village. And I do these posters for this Halloween event and this is the finished piece after I scanned it into the computer. But this is the black and white image that's all India ink that we were just uh, talking about before. The class is called Comic Book Creation, so I, I enjoy working with the students. I feel like I'm an art director. I kind of get them off on their own story. I help them a little bit with it, and then I, I come by and I help them um, with panel arrangements. A panel arrangement is showing the scenes where, the, for instance, I'm showing the character opening his basement door, he comes down the stairs of his basement, and then I show a long scene here that establishes what his basement looks like. Um, and these are all different camera angles, camera shots. So I try to get that across to the students when they're telling their story, doing a comic book. Um, why else I like uh, teaching this class? I enjoy um, helping the, the students with character designs. Um, I will throw out names silly names that I make up and then I have them all design their own version of the characters and it's always fun to see the different takes that the students do with these names that I throw out at them. These are called ink wash. This is Mr. Spock from Star Trek. Um, I'm using different color inks to create these these um, images here and you might recognize some of them. There's a Twilight Zone one I'm working on right now. It's not quite completed. I got to run the inks through the gray tones throughout this uh, figure here. Anyway, I love monsters. I love superheroes. I love comedy. I'm able to do that in this class. And it's just a lot of fun working with these guys. And I appreciate Jordan wanting to uh, do this with me. Let's go talk to some other people in the class and see what they're up to. Yeah, class is that definitely pretty fun. I've been here for two years. Uh, uh, it's a great way to release some stress, work on drawing, uh, chat to friends. Uh, it's just a great place to be. It gives me the freedom to draw my characters how I want to, and I can make my own comics, I can make my big old comic cover, I can draw them in different styles, I can figure out how, how I want them to look, and just fix them up when I have no time at home to even do it or even in school, so...